welcome back to my channel if you are new on my channel my name is Hanot and I welcome you to my channel feel free to subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell icon beside the subscribe button to get my new videos straight to your phone like you can be the first person to get the video why not and I assure you you're gonna enjoy watching this channel so guys thank god it's summer <laughs> I know summer is the season that everybody is waiting for and we tend to gain a lot of weight in this summer because we love to eat ice cream a lot and today I'll be showing you something that is more healthy that can be used as a substitute for your ice cream I'm going to show you how I made this my fruit lollipop you can call it pop say anything you want to call it but I call it fruit lollipop so <laughs> this is one set you can see this one and I have another set here very healthy very very healthy and here is another one so has been eating out of this <laughs> so here is another one and um, you have different choices like different things you can you know it's just so healthy and so cheap your children are gonna love it because they are as, as sweet as your ice cream believe me guys my son love this so 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 much so guys don't let me talk too much just let's get straight into this video and i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye so here i have my strawberry i have bananas and i have kiwi also that is mango so i'll be blending my strawberry first i'm blending without water Next, I'm going to be blending my banana. Banana tends to change color after a while, so I'm just going to be using it like that because I really want to use banana for this fruit lollipop. Don't forget that you can also freestyle, you can get creative with this, you can use any kind of fruit you want. You can also use fruit juice. Now I'm blending in my kiwi. So this kiwi is not as green as I expected. I was actually thinking of getting different colors like green um, with kiwi, yellow with mango, red with strawberry, and something like white with banana. But this, but this kiwi is not as green as I thought it would be. So I'm just gonna use it like that. I added some water to this mango because it cannot blend on its own. I don't want to spoil my blender. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm going to be using this lollipop mode. I got them from the store and you can also buy from Amazon, AliExpress, from different kind of stores, online stores. So I'm adding my mango to the mold and I'm cleaning it up because I just want it to be different colors. So now I'm adding in my strawberry to it. It can get messy. All I just do is I just try to I just try to clean up after whatever mess has happened. So now you can see that the banana has changed color. That's what happens to banana when you leave them for a while. So I'm adding in banana to it now. And now I'll be holding my kiwi to it. Like I said earlier, I actually thought my kiwi would be greener than this. So to add a green color to this fruit lollipop bar, there's no green color now because the kiwi is not as green as I thought. So I'm just going to use it like that. Now I'm adding my stick to it and I'm going to put it to freezer. They need to be ready for eating. So beautiful, guys. So lovely. What I'll be doing now is that I'll be adding this yogurt, then I'm adding milk to it. Now I'm adding my banana to it. The next thing I'm adding now is my honey. You can add sugar, but I don't want to add sugar to this. I want to make it as healthy as possible, so I'm adding my banana to eat and my honey to eat then I mix everything together now that everything has been well mixed I'm going to be adding my strawberry sliced here 
I'm going to be adding this to it now. And then I mix properly. Then I add it to my lollipop mold. So like I said, this can get really messy. So I tried to change my style by using spoon. <laughs> So now I'm going to clean up the mess and before I put my sticks into it. And that's it guys. That is the second fruit lolly. So let's move to the next one. The next lolly I'll be, I'll be doing now is like the first one that we did. It's just going to be strawberry in the lollipop mode. So I missed the footage of adding the mango to it but yeah I added mango to it and that's how it looks. Now I have two colors. I have strawberry and I have my mango. Now it's ready to be taken to the freezer and after that after it's frozen it's ready to be eaten. So that is it guys. What I'm just doing here is that I don't want to waste the remaining fruit so I'm just adding them to the lollipop mode like different colors in different modes that's what i'm just doing here and that's it guys thank you so much for watching i hope you get creative with this use any kind of fruits you like and you can also use fruit juice this can be really really delicious guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video bye